Hey everybody, welcome back again to Wisconsin Guy Reviews here. We are going to be doing a follow-up review on our uh, Guyron Vacuum Sealer E2900-MS series. Uh, I did a video on my review a few months after I got it, so this is going to be well into the lifespan of of this vacuum sealer. Um, it is going great, it's going strong. I'll leave a link down in the description below uh, for the uh, link to the first video. So you can go and check that out if you want. Uh, one of the things I did mention in there that I didn't get the test was the ability for this to have a gentle mode. Um, and I really kind of like that because uh, I like to do breads, so I have some banana bread here, and I have some cinnamon bread from Costco, which, if you've never tried that, go to Costco, get a three-pack of their cinnamon bread, and be prepared to eat all three, probably, in a whole weekend. They're that good. Uh, so I did try the Gentle Cycle, and one, it just didn't seem to seal it as well, and two, it squished a lot of the bread. You can't see it in this one because it's obviously the vacuum seal didn't go as well. Um, but it just didn't, it just didn't do it. And even when it was sealing it up and it would crush the bread, uh, my understanding is the gentle mode wouldn't do that. Um, so that's about the only thing that I didn't like about that. But the remedy for that is freeze your bread first and then vacuum seal it. So, um... Again, that's my only complaint with this unit. So we'll actually get this bread taken out. I got another bag set up over here. And uh, as you can see from the shadow of my hand, how about we point this way, right there. Uh, so we'll take this one, put it in the new bag, and we'll just show you how that seals up just for the fun of it. All right, so we got the bread all uh, put in the new bag and we're all good to go there. So we have it on dry and normal. So we're just gonna hit back seal. And it should seal it up. We'll see how it goes. I don't know about you, but I love vacuum sealing stuff. It's awesome just to watch all the air get sucked out. One of those satisfying type videos. Again, this unit does it pretty quickly. And the one thing I like that I mentioned in previous videos is you can see the seal light will go on here shortly. It still vacuum seals it as it's sealing it. Uh, my food saver that I had did not do that before. Um, so I was not a fan of that. I overpaid for it. And uh, this is a much better unit for a lot less price. So as you can see, it's good to go. No issues. And the bread sealed up good. So again, uh, I'll leave a link in the description below to the first video. Uh, let me know if you plan or have bought this unit or if you plan to buy it. I'd, I'd like to hear your comments in the description below about uh, what what characteristics you'd like to look for in a vacuum sealer and if this video helped you. Uh, appreciate you stopping by and thanks a lot.